Okay, welcome everyone to Stardew Valley Day 2. Um, unfortunately, I, when I was watching my VOD back from last week, noticed that I didn't click the button needed so that we get that red cabbage in the first year. And um, so I have to restart the entire run. It's okay, we only got like four days in, so it's not so bad. But we are going to be restarting from the beginning today and actually clicking that box so that if we don't finish the challenge, it's not because of bad luck, it's just because of bad skill, you know? Yeah. Um, also, today is going to be a little bit of a shorter stream. I have a physical therapy appointment at 2, so I'm going to hop off at 1 so that I can be there in time for that. But yeah, happy Monday. I hope everyone's having a wonderful beginning of their week. And we're just going to get right into it, because we got to kind of go fast today. So, new game. I also added more cats, because I wanted more cats. It's pretty much going to be the exact same deal. So, we're still Polly. We're still at Pocket Farm. Oh no, we missed a pee. And our favorite thing is still Polly Pockets, so. There we go. Did it only add like one extra? Huh. Weird. Well, I like the calico. It is cute. Skin 23. Our hair is like 50 or 70 something. We're just really gonna speed through this since we already did it last week. I think it was this one that turns the really cool shade of pink. Hair color, go all the way over this way. Oh wait, just kidding. It is this. So cute! Okay. And then... I think I might change up the outfit from what I had saved last time, just because I went through again and I found other things that I like a little bit better. This is the one. Like pants. Good, it's a skirt. I can't describe to you how mad I got when I accidentally chose shorts instead of a skirt once. I did not like it. Okay, let's get them a little bit lighter. Yeah, is that cute? Maybe just a skosh darkened up. Beautiful. Okay. Accessory. I'm always so torn about the lipstick. I wish you could choose like a different color for it, I think. Is that just earrings? I think so. It's kind of cute on my floppy ears. I'm so torn. Okay, we're gonna fix up our eye color so that it's green. I think I like the lips with the red outfit. Perfect. Okay, and we're going into here and we're checking that guarantee one year completable so that we get the red cabbage at some point from the traveling cart. Because if I lose this challenge, it's going to be from a skill issue. Not because of bad luck. I also did, I already checked the last save to see if um, it would 
have the red cabbage spawn at the traveling cart because that does happen sometimes by chance but I had no such luck so from the beginning we go okay I think all of this I want to just stay the same cool profit margin oh you can make your profit higher no we're not doing that Okay, and you can do remix mine rewards, but that's something we get later on. Okay, cool. That's what we're doing. I feel so funny that I downloaded a mod and it didn't even add, like, half of the cats it said it was going to. So sad. I think I like this calico cat the best. So that's what we're gonna keep. Okay. I think this is it. This is our final design. Meet Polly. Okay, and we are gonna skip the intro on this one because I did it a few days ago. I don't wanna go through it again. We're gonna do the forest farm still. Yeah. All right, and let's just hop right in. taking a second to load. Hopefully everything's okay. There we go. Perfect. Alright, let's go. We got this. Got our parsnip seeds. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Bubs. All right, clear this out. Hopefully, this run is kind of similar luck-wise to last one because we had that really nice, like, early crop fairy. And myself all set up in my craft room and I have to keep the door shut in here because there's just lots of stuff that my cats get into and like want to eat and play with they just shouldn't but they're both just sat right outside being so sad okay I'm gonna get all these our tap area is gonna be that little like circle that was down into the right As is always the drill for day one, I want enough wood for a chest, and we need 18 slots to plant all of our bounty. Sucks that I went live with the wrong title, but that's okay. I'll fix it when I'm done. That is nice that you can like retroactively fix your VOD title. Okay. Now we need to focus on hoeing. One. Oops. <laughs> two, three, four, five. One, two, three. And then we're just gonna do it off to the side since it already wanted to do that way. Gosh, I can't believe I did this to myself. I've also done the very beginning of this game now like so many times in the last two or three months because I'm doing a run with my younger sister and we had to restart because 
you know, I got a new Xbox and all the fun stuff. Oh, it's gonna make me get rid of something. Okay, hold on. We're just gonna drop this. <laughs> okay, let's try to make something. Chest. And then we're gonna drop that. Okay. And then we'll get it back. Yeah. That's gonna go right there. Yay. Okay, we have stuff to put in. Grab that, plant all of our parsnips, and then we'll head over to Pierre's and buy our green bean, potato, and cauliflower. Oh wait, drop off some of our tools as well so we don't overly <coughs> exhaust. Excuse me, sorry about all that. Um, get rid of that watering can. We'll keep the hoe and the scythe, though. Organize and to Pierre's. I forgot to read out the goals for today, but I do have all of the goals for every single day written out. I assume we'll get to about the exact place that we stopped last time which is fine. I'm not bitter at myself or anything for doing the one thing I needed to do to ensure I could complete my goals. <laughs> hey, Sam. Hey, I'm Sam, good to meet ya. A dandelion, or a daffodil. Those are really good gifts in the beginning game. I'm excited about that. Fuck you, Morris, I don't care about your birthday. Abigail. Aw, you're so cute. We look so cute together. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Okay, we need one green bean, one cauliflower, one potato. That is gonna be it for now. for today. I feel lost since I didn't read them out loud. I'm pretty sure I'm just foraging and talking to people. Oh, okay. We want to go look for those spring onions that are down by the sewer area or by Leah's place. Introduce yourself to villagers, loot garbage cans, plant crops, and make a chest. Okay, okay. Looting garbage cans is going to be a big thing. I always, like, I, I just don't do that. So, is that Harvey over there? Yeah, it is. Hey, Dr. Harvey. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures. Ah, nothing. Nuts. I wonder if you can only loot from garbage cans after you see Linus do it. Hi, Haley. You're gonna be rude to me, but that's okay. Oh, she actually wasn't that bad. I am that new farmer girl. Yes, indeedy. Oops. No spring onions. What's this way? I also don't think I've explored all of the 
expanded areas of the map. Sophia is not home, it doesn't look like, or she's outside. Is that? Yeah, there she is. She's working. Eek, a stranger. Wait, are you Polly, the new farmer? Sorry, I get a little nervous around people I haven't met before. My name is Sophia. I'm the owner of the Blue Moon Vineyard. Cool, Sophia. Nice to meet you. So pleased to meet you. So pleased to meet you. Ooh. Is that a conch? I feel like those are kind of rare in the early game. Hey, what's up, Elliot? <gasps> Something to turn into the museum. That's good, because if we turn in five things to the museum, we get nine cauliflower, and I definitely want to do that. Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thanks, bud. Pleasure to meet you, too. This is going pretty well, honestly. Let's go loot around here. Maybe meet Gunther. Ooh! Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. We can donate some glass today. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable, it's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it's yours. Sorry, I was really vibing to the music there for a second. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Yeah, for sure, Zs, dude. Think about it, will ya? Absolutely. If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Gunther. We're gonna donate to the museum. These glass shards. I really don't know where to put them. I hate that you can't organize things a little bit better. Glass shards are gonna go down here. Yeah, 250 Gs from that? That's amazing. This run is going really well. I'm super pleased with this so far. Cultivate and harvest parsnip. We've already got that started. I've greeted 9 out of 31 people. Did this count as Gunther? I think you don't have to greet him for actual. Prices will go up year by year, so getting stuff early is always a good idea. Okay, met Clint. Hey, 420. Smoke them if you got them. I think I've hit almost every single 420 of stream. That could be a new goal. Who dat? I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Oh, it's Shane. Hi, I haven't seen you before. Sorry, I, I don't know, really know you that well. Okay, we'll stop talking to you so that we don't freak you out like I did that one time. Morris, let me in, you coward. Okay. Ah, 
It's Farmer Polly. Welcome to the Valley. My name is Morris, manager of Joja Mart. If you need cheap quality seeds, there's no better place than Joja. Anyone else here? Nope. So fresh and so clean, clean. You know what? Since we're having such a good day, I might stop in and give my love Emily a uh, daffodil. Oh, hey there. You're the new owner of Pocket Farm. I'm Victor. It's a pleasure to meet you. Polly, is it? You're cute. And new. Unfortunately, my heart is taken. Although I do have the free love mod on this. So, I could technically date whoever I want. Hey, look, it's Robin and Demetrius. Oh, and Linus is going to be up here, too. Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. No, I haven't met your children because they're fucking recluses. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Yeah, for sure, these guys. <gasps> Linus, oh my god, and a mushroom? Y'all, we are hashtag blessed today. A stranger? Hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. Like, so hashtag blessed. Okay, we have three things to plant. Green bean stalk, cauliflower, and a potato. Um, I'm gonna put one dandelion and both daffodils away. I think this common mushroom can be used for something and I'm pretty sure all three of those can too. So we're just gonna sell this stuff and then take one daffodil to Emily. Okay, sell, sell, all right. To the bar. This was a really good first day. Oh, wait. Oh my god, an arrowhead. Wow. I'm so impressed. Give it to her yet. Greet her first. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. So the reason I'm wanting to make friends with Emily is because she gives really good gifts for the community center, namely like cloth and stuff. And then I also want to befriend Gu or not Gus, Linus, for the same reason. Hello there, I'm Gus. Gus, I think, also gives really good gifts. So, hey, kid, name's Pam. And buy you a drink if I could afford it. Yeah, that's fair, dude. Don't. Don't put yourself out. Okay, and we've talked to Clint and Shane today. You know, I think this run is going better than the last one is anyways. Or did. 17 out of 31 people greeted? Fuck yeah. You'll love to see it. Okay, let's go loot some garbages. And then head home for the night, I think. I'm really wondering if it just like doesn't give you anything until after those cutscenes. So excited we got an another artifact. And artifacts that aren't gems too, because gems are good. I want to mostly focus on gems for like selling and 
Um, fuck. I lost my train of thought. Tomorrow is going to be a fishing day. Level 1 foraging. Awesome. We got our axe proficiency up. Tree sometimes drops seeds. We got field snake and wild seed crafting recipes. Cool. All right. Now we're going to properly start a day and read out our goal list. Okay, day two of spring, we want to water crops and gather wood and make another chest. Then we're going to head down to the beach at 9 a.m. and get the fishing rod from Willie. Put the chest by the fishing area. Yeah, fish all day at the beach. We're going to give a daffodil to Emily. We might not do that since we did it yesterday. Um, loot garbage bins and selfish. Hello there, just got back from the fishing trip. I've got something for you. Thanks, Willie. any like forageable food yesterday so that might make fishing today a little bit more difficult hopefully we can find some okay i'm also gonna plant one of each of the seeds over in that tapper area that i want to make today We've got 50 wood, that's good. Exhausted ourselves doing it though. Oak and maple. And then those are pines, so yeah. We need an oak and a maple down here. goodness. Okay, put all that away. Keep the hoe. to the beach now and forage on the way for some foods. Oh, how do you make a field snack? Acorn maple seed pine cone. Let's make some of those. We can only make one. That's okay. 
field snack. That will be helpful for us. Going down is probably the most efficient way to get to the beach, but I do like this spot right here for forageable most of the time, so I like to try to hit it whenever I can. Jazz. What's up, sweet pea? Hi. You know, something that I never caught was that Jazz is Shane's, like, goddaughter. I thought that she was, like, Marnie's niece, so, like, his cousin, I guess. Miss me, listen, Mama's not nice. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Oh, buddy. there, miss. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, Maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. You received a bamboo pole. Nice. Fishing day, fishing day. There's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old poppy used to say anyway. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Actually, you know what? We are gonna stick in this area. And just fish from here. We won't take Willie's spot today. Well, damn, maybe we should go to Willie's spot. So close to being perfect, but so far. I love the floppy ears when she fishes. It is so cute. The ear mod was a good decision. Oh yeah, I'm also going to be putting like a mod list into my discord that uh, has all the mods that I'm using for this run through and I'm going to upload my like daily goals as kind of like a, a guide so that if I do end up completing this challenge I'll have a guide like fully written out already on how to do it and other people will be able to use it if they want to as well. Mm -hmm. 
This is good. I think we need... I don't know if we need an anchovy or sardine. I think we need one or both of them for the community center bundles. So the plan is to save one of everything that we need for the community center and then um, sell everything else. So hopefully we make quite a bit of cash today. I've heard that's one of the biggest challenges to this run, is making money quickly enough. I personally am not, like, super great at making tons of money in Stardew. I know s some people are amazing at it, like, making millions in the first season and stuff, but... I don't know if I'm going to be anything close to that. Silver Star stuff is really impressive for my first day, I think. I'm so excited. It's like I'm getting better or something. where to put the chest that it won't get like stomped on. Maybe just right there. Forget what all fish are in the ocean in the summer. Ooh, six inches. Okay, I'm gonna eat my field snack here soon. That would have been the easiest perfect ever, and I ruined it. It's okay. You live and you do. God, the ocean noises are so relaxing. Mmm. trying to get these perfect because it makes your fishing level go up so much quicker. For 20! Blaze it! I just keep getting lucky with those. Herring. Okay, so we are gonna eat this. Yes, eat it. Okay, got a little bit of energy back. And place this. I feel. Right there. I'm feeling it. sure a herring is one of the things for the bundles. I should check the bundles and see what we've got that we uh, can use for them. Hold on. Whoops. Knock stuff over on my desk while I'm at it. 
Okay. So we need a sardine, which we definitely have, a tuna, a red snapper, and a tilapia for the ocean fish bundle. And yeah, so the rest of this is just going to be good, good money, good money. We only need to save the sardine, I'm pretty sure. Sardine, 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 sardine. Sorry, I'm checking through one more time because I just... That seems a little bit too good to be true, but it's true. It's true. Okay. Let's go. That's amazing. That means I get to save so much freaking money. Or, like, make so much money. silver star fish mm -hmm. I believe we I want to get at least one perfect today at least one <sighs> it wasn't bad it just wasn't perfect Perfect fish. Ah, oh, it didn't even have a star though. That's okay. It will do good for the fishing level. I think my fishing level went up. The bar looks bigger. That's exciting. I'm starting to feel exhausted. Well, last one. And then we will head around town and try to loot garbage cans. See if we can. Okay, damn. Disappointing that it was seaweed on the last one. Nope, nope, nope. Ah! Okay, you need to stop. That was bad. Can I eat seaweed? Aha!
we're just gonna eat all of this, so I hopefully... is full, actually. So I will not be... Uh, looting garbage cans on the way home. I will just be going home. Also should make oh god stop doing that legitimately stop fuck me I might have to go all the way around damn it I wonder if I can just go around the lake on this side. We have potential. We're good. We're totally good. Okay, I do want to check to see if the conch is part of one of the bundles. It's not part of the crab pot. Anywhere else? Truffle poppy monkey roll. Nautilus shell. Bum 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 bum. Okay, yeah, I don't think we need the conch for anything. Good stuff. Although, we still haven't found any wild leeks or wild, wild horseradishes, so that's... Okay, we need to keep exactly one sardine. We already have that. We can take this as well. Yeah? And then I think we can actually get rid of this mushroom as well too, because I didn't see that anywhere on the bundles list. Okay. Hopefully this will let us quite a bit of money for today. exhausted tomorrow. Less than ideal. Okay, just trying to make as much money as we can. Go to sleep for the night. Alrighty, our fishing rod proficiency is up. We're level one fishers. Not bad, 1200. I think we're getting close to being able to buy ourselves the backpack upgrade. Hey, 
Hey, it's raining. Okay. Day three of spring. Let's check our goals list. We need to gather wood. Make another chest. Mm, do we need to make another chest, though? We're not going to make another chest yet. We're just going to gather more wood. Head to the river for fishing. Fish all day at the river. Loot garbage on the way home. And sell fish. Okay, yeah. That seems like a good list for the day. Excuse me. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Yeah, getting close to being able to buy that backpack, but not quite there yet. Okay, grab our axe. Let's just grab all of our tools so that we can clear out more of the farm. Bam, 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 bam. Hopefully we get enough seeds for some more field snacks today. That would be dope. Oh, that's exciting. Might have gone a little bit ham today, but we can at least make like one more field snack, I think. And hopefully, we'll find stuff along the way today. We're getting close. I want to get that 300 open because that other part of the beach has really good forageables. And. Gosh, back to it. Got our hoe and our bamboo. Make a field snack really quick. Oh, I do want some torches as well. We're going to make three of those. And one, two, three. Cool. Bam, bam. To the river. Let's go down.
of grace into depths of oblivion into the level of space Of course, I only have that one portion of the song stuck in my head. Down by the river, I was drawn by your grace into the depths of oblivion, into the love of space. I was full of tears and of lines. Started looking up and up. Oh, I wasted a lot of time this morning. Gathering wood. What time is it? Okay, it's 12-ish. Ooh, exciting! Silver star! Oh god, oh god, oh god. That was probably a catfish, damn. Oh, I need to eat something. Kitties. Poor sad kitties. Oh, I'm starting to feel exhausted. I forgot to eat, guys. Okay. Yes, eat the field snack. Eat the algae. Yes. And yes. Down by the river, mm -hmm. I was drowned by your grace into the depths of a river, into the love of space. Full of tears and of light. A wing! <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, 
a gold star shad! That is really awesome, actually. Fuck yeah! Okay, we're in a really good spot. Um, get rid of the CD, I think. Yeah! That's really exciting. Okay, I'm gonna forage now. Oh, it's a silver star catfish, too. There we go. Mm -hmm. Let go places. Hi, Eva. Welcome in. Or is it Ava? How how do you pronounce that? I'm doing really, really good. Uh, just playing some Stardew Valley this morning. I am from Oregon in the United States. How about yourself? Are you a Stardew Valley fan? What brings you in? And thank you so much for dropping in. I appreciate it a lot. It's lovely to have you. Oh my god, it's so foggy down here. Error Zero. Hi, and nice to see you as well. Welcome in the chat, guys. How y'all doing? Oh, this is a different little area. Oh, right, okay, this is where Fairhaven Farm is, so this is part of the extended version. Are you a Stardew Valley as- or a Stardew Valley fan as well, Error? Yep, how long have you been playing? And like, console, PC, do you do mods? Wow, they added so much in the extended version. That's incredible. Two months and console. I started on console. And um, my husband dug up one of his old gaming laptops for me. So this is my first time playing it modded, and it's so much fun. It's like a nice refresher for the game. Oh, 
Who's your favorite character? Do you have any favorite characters? Okay, drop all this off. We can sell two of our horseradishes and keep one. Krobus, I love Krobus. That's one of my goals for this run, is to make Krobus my roommate. <laughs> those away. I think we can sell all the chubs. I'm going to take a look at my bundle list really quickly just to make sure I'm not selling anything I need. I think I need a shad. Fish tank. Yes, I need a shad. I need a catfish, so I'll keep both of those. Sad that I can't sell my catfish. Keep that. And all the rest can sell. You're going to try the mod, but it's a bit much for you. Yeah, modding is not the easiest venture sometimes. Are you a big gamer in general, or do you... Is it just Stardew Valley? Does it just have your heart? What is the weather for tomorrow? Clear and sunny? Okay. Let's grab this out. We only need one of those. And I'm keeping daffodils for more purposes than just the community center. You can play what you can afford to, TBH. Yep, I'm pretty much in the same boat. A lot of Game Pass games for me. Yeah, we need all our tools for tomorrow, and let's head to bed. Level 2 fishing, heck yes. We can craft bait now. This is going very well. Okay, neutral spirits, not bad. Okay, and then I think today's agenda is pretty much more fishing. I forgot to read my goal lists in the morning. Oh no. Okay, reading goals for today. Day four, spring. We need to water crops, gather wood, buy a backpack upgrade. We absolutely can do that. Go to the mountain lake for fishing, fish all day, loot garbage on the way home. Cool. Sounds like a good plan to me. And it's Thursday, so Pierre's is open. Please. Do I not have my pickaxe? Silly.
nice. Our seeds are starting to grow over there. Get rid of this. Oh my god, look at all the butterflies. Those are so pretty. Texture of the bus is so cute. It's still Thursday. Hi, Maru. I don't think we've met yet in this run. I am. Craving for Bream, please bring one by for me. Yeah. Oh. I always do the wrong, I like forget if it's a left click or a right click for stuff. Let's get this backpack. Winners. Alright, up to the mountain lake for the day. Ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. And I still need to find a leak for the community center foraging bundle for spring. Actually, I'm a professional graphic designer. I do Twitch stuff like overlay packs, emotes, models, YouTuber. Oh, thanks, Eva. I'm actually uh, designing my own channel, and I'm just, like, having fun with it. So it's not something I really am trying to put a lot of money in towards right now. But thank you so much for the offer. So I haven't noticed anything that's too much more difficult about the mod error. Um, I, I know that it will extend, like, storylines. So I put Stardew Valley Expanded in here. I haven't met all of the characters and I haven't seen all of the new areas yet, which is exciting. But I don't think it will up the difficulty too much. Just the way that I'm playing might. Because I'm trying to go really fast. Oh no, I don't need anything built. Thanks though, Robin. Not right now at least. Oh wait, is your son alive? Can I go and speak to him? If you have, um, like a link to a social or anything, Eva, if one day I am trying to like spend a little bit more money on stream, I'll definitely go and check you out. If you want to just drop it. Thanks, Robin. It's 11 a.m. and Sebastian is still just chilling in his room. Same Z's. Hi, Linus. No, here, have this. Be my friend. The mines are going to be open tomorrow. I hate when you get like really close to perfect, but you just barely miss it. Hey, I'm a fisherman. 
I think my fishing level just went up. That's exciting. It's just after 5 p.m. The traveling merchant won't be here until tomorrow. They, she comes on Friday and Sunday. But yes, I will be heavily relying on her because um, she, the only way that you can complete this run actually is by getting the red cabbage from her cart at some point during year one. So yeah, every Friday and every Sunday I have it on my, um, I have like a written out list of what I need to do every single day. Um, but yeah, I have it marked so that I don't miss any of them and ruin my run on accident. dragon now or has it always been there no it's new that's my new little dragon I still need to name him that is the dragon needs a name so if anyone has any like epic name suggestions feel free to drop them in the chat <laughs> not puff I assume that would be pretty funny. Some people say puffer fish is important too. Not sure why though. It's hard to catch the, push the puffer fish if you're not very good at fishing yet. Um, so a lot of people will opt to buy it instead of trying to catch it. Because the fishing mini game in is honestly, it's pretty difficult. And some people just never really get the hang of it. No glasses yet. We're still all snowy over here. I have a doctor's appointment though. So I am going to be ending early today. I'll hop off in like half an hour-ish. I actually might hop off after this day just to make sure I don't go over. No flips table. <laughs> That's how I feel. I low key almost want to like drive out to the USPS facility and be like, hey, can I have those? They've just been chilling here for like a week. I would, I would really like them. Hello. 
Hell yeah, give me a perfect. Winning! Oh my god, what is that? It's tiny! A minnow? I think that's new. Any snow removal yet? Um, so the main roads are good in Portland right now, but um, all of our neighborhoods and side streets are fucked still. It is melting quite a bit today, so hopefully we are at the end of the snow. Oh, fuck. I feel sluggish from overexertion. I need to pay better attention to that. Noise! Yes, I'm, I'm very glad about the main roads and everything. Larry's been able to get to work safely. <laughs> okay, let's eat some of our algae. Hey, it's Sebastian! I can finally meet him! Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Yeah, dude. I got a free farm. You would also move to any town in the world, probably, if you got a free farm. Free. Okay, let's go loot some garbage cans. Like dirty little trash gremlins. not one outside of Joja? I thought there was. Boop. I feel like I have yet to actually find anything from these garbage cans. I'm wondering if it's not working. They're supposed to be super helpful. Okay, there are like two more down here, and then we'll call it. Aha, it tried to hide from me. Bullhead is something we need for the community center, and I know for a fact the largemouth base is. Bass. Everyone's up the mountains, don't tell us it's better. just got like a shuffle of songs going on in my head right now it's very confusing go there um save one save that i don't i haven't seen a minnow as part of any of these packs so i'm gonna assume that i don't need it and i'm just gonna sell it Five years, five years, still you, still me, still here. Five years, five years, baby, five years, five years. Okay, I'm going to run around and see if I can't find a leak. Because it's crazy that it's day four, and I have yet to find everything for the foraging bundle. Five. 
five years, five years, baby. No, but there's another horseradish. Aw, he's sleeping. Never mind. That's awkward. I feel a little Edward pulling with that one. It is indeed getting late. We have... Cool, yeah. Drop this off, sell it, head to bed, and I think that is gonna be the end of game for me today. Did not make a lot of money, but that's okay. We still have time. All right, stop it right here. Thank you so much to everybody who joined in the stream today, chatted, thanks to the new chatters, Error and Ava. It was so lovely to meet you guys and hang out. Thanks to Pops for hopping in there at the end. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your Monday today. I am streaming Stardew uh, for the foreseeable future here uh, every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday on this channel from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. So feel free to drop by and join me again. I would love to have you. Thank you again so much, everyone. I will hopefully see you in the next one. We're gonna do this. It's gonna get a little bit awkward for a second. But, bye!